Hello everyone, and welcome! I am Moonblast, and today we'll be playing a game of Risk Global Domination. Here are my stats already, and let's find ourselves a game. Ooh, Spaceport Sigma. Looks like a cool map, but I feel like the chance of me losing it would be pretty high. Let's see if we can find someone else, something else. Ooh, iBay and Buddies. Don't mind if I do. Alrighty, we got into this game quick. I'll try Space War Sigma, you know, sometime. Definitely will. Man, you can't beat iBay and Buddies, though. This map smacks. I guess I'll at least try to be blue if I can't be purple, you know? What? Oh, man. Oh, well. Well, now we're full. Alright, let's do this. I cannot remember the last time I played as green. Yeah, I don't, I don't remember ever playing as green before, so I guess let's see how this game goes. Alright, one person's a computer. Did it just say a beginner computer is going to take over? Uh oh. I can't go with the strategy I've done on the last three playthroughs on this map. So I don't have any troops in that spot. I suppose I could always go there, but. Oh snap! Red. Red's got good placement. Well... Alright. I suppose I'll go for the green continent, shall... Shall I? I mean, I suppose I could go for that other continent, work my way over there. It would take a little bit, but it'd be possible. Or should we try something new? Dang, people have destroyed a lot of my troops so far. Like, relax, y'all. Ooh. No, I don't need charcoal right there, man. Like, like charcoal, how am I supposed to expand if you're right there? Could you imagine if charcoal... Loses all her troops is trying to destroy Purple's 3 right there. Ooh, that'd be amazing. If I could sab- if, like, Charcoal is- like, does something crazy and, like, gets way too aggressive and I could steal all their, like, con- like, all their area, that'd be amazing. Ooh, Porcelain is going after the spot. Yep. Like, I, I made sure to get the, the computer away from me, man. Because wherever they put their... Oh, yes, dude, they're going to sabotage red. Oh, that's beautiful, man. Oh, no, they went the wrong way. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, mm. Like, they sabotaged red by putting those troops there, but they didn't destroy their, their three troops. So, it's just a little bit of a... A sl little slow, slow bound, but see, they only lost one troop. Dang it, Purple, you had the opportunity to really slow Red down, man. That stinks. Oh well. Yeah. Ooh. Purple's smart getting the, the computer as far away from them as possible, man. 
because they'll do stupid stuff like that, and that's why I kicked them out of the spot, out of the continent that I'm going for. It's just like I don't want any of that craziness here, man. You know. Luckily, there's five purple troops in the continent that blue is going for, so that'll slow them down a decent amount. Red's decently far away from me, so I don't really have to worry about them trying to conquer me just yet. But, um... The more they're slowed down, the better, because they could take their continent on their next turn, and that would not be ideal for us. Hopefully, Charcoal gets super greedy and loses lots of troops. We'll see, though. Or they could have really good luck. We'll see. Hmm. Yo, did Charcoal leave the game? No. They were probably thinking about if they should get greedy or not, but luckily, I mean, for, uh, for their pers perspective, luckily they didn't get too greedy. It's never good to get too greedy. Alright. We'll take this continent soon. Do we, do we have good cards so far? Yeah, I'll take that. I'll take that. Oh, snap. Ooh. Horselin is doing the strat. Yes, they are. Yo, Horselin, relax, man. Um, we, I guess we could try and take our continent on our next turn. I mean, I don't want to get left behind and all, that's for sure. Dang, I have one, two, three defense spots though, so that sucks. Obviously, the, um, nobody is going for the purple continent right now, so I don't have to put too much troops right there to protect it. Ooh, blue might... Blue will just... Blue will probably get, um... Their continent, not on this turn, but the turn after that. Red will get their continent this turn, as long as they just, just go for it, you know. Yeah, at this point, I don't know if Charcoal will be able to take their continent, man. Charcoal is weak. Really, really badly weak, man. I mean, if they get good cards, they can, but if they wait too long, Horuslin will just be able to carve them up, like, really, really badly, you know? Oh, there's alliances in this game? Heck yeah. Wait, blue is a computer? Very nice to know. Alright, so, blue and, blue and purple are a computer right now. Alright. Very good to know that, actually. Alright. So, Porcelain and Red, man. They both have a continent now, so they're definitely high risk. <gasps> blue! Oh, no, Blue! That is terrible. Oh, no. That was... Beyond terrible for us, man. Like, that was really, really bad for us. Really, really bad for us, man. Let's destroy these really quick. I don't know, did I just get randomly greedy for no reason? I don't know, man. Oh, uh, but Blue will just keep attacking you, though. Oh, man. If it wasn't for blue, I could be getting I could be getting a continent bonus, man. Yep. Dude, 
Orslin is not gonna let Charcoal get their continent. I guarantee it, man. There's no chance. Yep. Dude, that continent that Porcelain is in, man, that's the continent, man. Dang blue in there. In, I know, right? The computer just tore me up, man. We gotta. We must be careful, brother. Yes, we shall be. All right. The thing is that porcelain's growth rate, it's just gonna be out of this world. Like, I have to take a continent and hope I can hold it, man, because... Like, porcelain and red are gonna just get massive. Luckily, I'm not touching either of those continents, but it's not- it won't be long until they can come after me. I mean, technically, my continent gives one extra troop, but the having to defend three spots is not worth it. No chance. Oh. Oh. Yep. It won't be long until Red gets us, man. Alright. This is very dangerous waters right here. I mean, Red just cashing all their cards, though. But if Red takes that continent, we're the, we're, nobody's going to stand in their way, though, is the problem, man. Um, we have to take our continent this turn, dude. This turn. Hopefully blue doesn't cash in a whole bunch of troops and sabotages. Oh my. Yes, dude! Attack porcelain! Come on, do it. Actually, we need porcelain to attack red, though. That is true. At least they've stopped... Wait, they put... Oh, no! They put two extra troops there. Dude, blue, man, like the computer, man, stop sabotaging me, man. Attack blue. Do you know how many troops I would lose doing that, man? I just can't risk that, man. At least not yet. Alright, do we get a good card bonus? Ooh. No, I'll take that card bonus, but it's terrible, man. It's terrible. Well, I didn't want Red to get any funny ideas, but if Blue puts even more troops in that spot... Man. I mean, sometimes you just get really bad luck. Like, right here. I know, right, dude? Purple's cards look delicious right now, but... We just don't have the troops to get to them, you know? I think Red has this game easy, man. Red's gonna take that whole continent this turn. The purple continent. Like, it just took- it took me far too long to get a- to get this continent, man. Like, blue sabotage slowed me down to the point where I just couldn't come back. Ooh. But if we can- if blue doesn't take it for a little while, we sh we could be able to survive. Perhaps. Perhaps. We'll see, though. I mean, if I was blue, I would just go for it. Nobody can stop blue. They might still go for it. Yo. Oh my. Alright, hold, blue, hold. This is bad. There's no chance. 
We have no chance, man. Yo, Porcelain needs to attack Red, otherwise we're screwed. We are beyond screwed at this point, man. Like somebody, like anybody, man, attack Red, man. Yes! Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Blue. Thank you, Blue. Dude, Purple's cards look delicious, so, man. I'm gonna look so stupid cashing in a... Cashing in three infantry, but that's the best I got, man. And that's the truth of the matter. Like, relax, Red. Alright. Alright, boys. Let's get what let's get what rightfully belongs to us. Hey, not bad, not bad. Yo, stop sending me so many messages, Red. Like, holy cow. Alright. Alright, boys, we have ourselves a continent. We're alive. And but dude, Red's rate of growth is way too big, man. Way too big. No, I don't think Charcoal will attack me. Porcelain, on the other hand. Ooh, Porcelain is going for their second continent. You know? Wow. Ooh, is Porcelain going to sabotage Red? Obviously, they don't have to this turn. But if they did, it'd be amazing. Yeah, dude. Both... Both Red and Porcelain both have a secondary continent, but they haven't fought at all. Hopefully they do, man. Yo! Yo! Dude, Purple is gonna have five cards. Dude, the person that gets those cards Man, they're gonna be somebody, man. Could I get those cards? Yeah, I think I could. Red can't this turn. Yep, I'm gonna get those scrumptious cards of purples. And we might be in business. Problem is that our continent will be touching both red and porcelain. You know, that's not ideal. Ooh, that is very ideal, though. That is very much ideal. Like, in a map like this, you have to go big, man. You have to go big. So far, Porcelain and Red haven't started a war with each other, so... If you want to stay in the game, you have to grow large. And that's the truth of the matter, too. Haha, <laughs> Purple's cards are mine, dude. Yep, or Charcoal has no possible way of reaching them. If Charcoal could sabotage Red, though, that'd be amazing. Oh, Charcoal, you could have sabotaged Red. No matter. These scrumptious, delicious cards are mine. I am now a large threat on the board. You better believe it. Alright, thank you for those. Why does Red keep sending me all those messages? Like... I I don't need to be told how to play the game, man. Like, relax. Hmm. I don't want to start a massive war. Hopefully my, my pieces don't get sabotaged. Porcelain might sabotage my continent, though. We'll see. 
Although we have the cards to back up, back up a large offensive. Red won't mess with us because of our 24 troops right there. There's no chance. Porcelain, on the other hand, though, they might. They might. So we have to be careful, man. But then again, my 24 troops are also touching Porcelain's continent. You know, that that power that I have right there might keep them from attacking me. We'll see. That's why I always say, man, it's better to... Like, if you're playing with noobs, it might not work because they'll, they'll just see a one troop there and attack it. But if you're playing with people that are, like, decent or good, like, they'll see that one troop there, they'll be like, hmm. But they have a 24 army there. And they know that if they get rid of my content bonus, those troops are going for them. You know? So that's why that's able, I mean, you're able to do that in matches with people that are good. And so far, everyone has played pretty well, you know? Obviously, red will probably take their continent this turn. Um, I don't know what it'll take to get porcelain and red to attack each other. Red's inability to take their continent for so long has really weakened them badly. Dude, there, ain't, bro, there's no way that red isn't gonna take their purple continent. There we go. There we go. Now we have ourselves a game, folks. Now we have we have ourselves a game right here, boys. Interesting that Red is building up their barrier up there. You know? Interesting. The, you, it might be to protect themselves from the computer, honestly. Okay, do not destroy my troops up there, Bluth. Oh, smokes. Dude, that, then again, who needs to farm cards when you have two continents, though? Yo, could I- could you imagine if I entirely sabotaged, um... I mean, I could imagine it, that's for sure. Wipe red off the map, you say? Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Did I just do a big move? Yes, I did. Obviously, Porcelain's gonna sabotage me bad. If I'm able to keep these continents for even one turn, that's game over for everybody. Yo, Porcelain, attack me, bro. I don't know, man. I just, like... Sometimes you just, like... Like, you... you I don't know, I just, like, felt like... I felt like that might pay off, so we'll see if it pays off. As expected, they're gonna get rid of all my continents. Yep. I don't know, poor Charcoal has been so passive this game to where I didn't, I kind of, I don't know, like, like their troops are in a spot where they can't really attack at the moment, so I was just gonna leave them like that. Ooh. I still get to keep two continents though, that's big. <gasps> hold, 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 hold. Yes, dude, it held. Beautiful. Beautiful. 
I get to I got to keep two continents. That's beautiful. Well, charcoal can't really do too much on this turn because their 32 troops are stuck. Should I have provoked a war against porcelain this early in the game? I don't know. It felt right, though. You know, it felt like the right thing to do. The real question is, what is charcoal? How is charcoal going to respond? So I feel strong enough to beat porcelain, but if charcoal teams up against me, yes. Oh my gosh, dude, that's beautiful, charcoal. Thank you, man. Thank you. Ho ho ho. Your doom has come, porcelain. Your doom has arrived, porcelain. Very nice. Very nice. Alright. Like, porcelain is getting weak, but they're not out, man. They're not out. Put some, put some extra troops over there so the computer doesn't attack us. Hopefully porcelain doesn't cash those in. If they do, though, we'll be in some big trouble. Ooh, that is really bad for us. They're going to do a lot of damage to our continents right now. That is for sure. Interesting. Okay. Ooh, actually, we're still going to take a lot of trouble. Yep, I should have moved those 11 troops downwards. I wanted to prevent the computer from stealing my stuff, but no, I should have focused solely on porcelain. Oh, that is bad, dude. That is really bad for us. Ooh! That mistake might cost porcelain the game right there. Steve, porcelain declared war on charcoal, man. That was a mistake, man. And we got to keep one continent. Beautiful. Beautiful. That's exactly why I put those troops there. I don't know, I'm just scared of blue stealing my continent. You know. Should I have put them... Should I have, should I have put them in um, the red continents to block charcoal from moving up? Yes, I should have. But that's alright. Ooh, the blue continent could attack. Blue could now attack, attack portion of their continent. Yep. We gotta focus on kicking charcoal out. I mean, kicking porcelain out. Cause um, porcelain's continent is in a really bad place at the moment. Thank you. Yes, dude. Beautiful charcoal. Thank you, man. Beautiful. Beautiful. Alright, let's just try and re reclaim as much as we can. You know. Obviously, we do not want to get charcoal attacking us, that's for sure. What we don't want to do is to attack that one spot right there. Because Porcelain will be able to use those troops to attack. On their next turn. And we do not want those troops unleashed on us. Hmm. I still want to keep this spot up here buffed up, man. Because if the computer sabotages us, that'd be really, really bad. Yep. You see, I did not want those 12 troops unleashed on me. No chance. Alright. 
Um, Porcelain's chances of winning pretty much doomed at this point. Porcelain has started a war of... They should never have started a war of charcoal. But then again, charcoal attacked them first, but they shouldn't have retaliated. You know? Oh, snap! Blue is gonna sabotage one of my continents, aren't they? Ooh, they sabotaged charcoal, too. Interesting. Well, as long as... As long as Charcoal is distracted from attacking me, that, that's alright with me, man. If they still attack Porcelain, that'd be amazing, though. We'll see. Beautiful. They didn't attack, um... You know, porcelain, which kind of stinks, but I can I can work with this man. All right. End of tr the end of porcelain is near. And honestly, if the computer wants to sabotage me, I suppose, man. I don't know. No, we, we gotta we gotta we gotta protect ourselves from the computer. That's for sure. All right, porcelain's doom arrives either way. Hmm. That's a lot of damage, though. Yep. Man, are we gonna be able to hold any continent? No, I think all of our continents are gone. Mm-hmm. Dang, dude, this stinks. Actually, we'll be able to hold, yeah. Hold... All right, hold. Hold. Ooh, that hurt, man. That hurt bad. All right. That hurt really bad, man, but that's all right. Is Blue gonna... Blue's gonna sabotage me bad, aren't they? Ooh, that's why I'm keeping the border up with blue, man. I don't need to get sabotaged from behind, too. Beautiful. Yep. So once the computer starts sabotaging you, man, they're not gonna stop, you know? Now, now they've sabotaged porcelain really badly. Alright. I need those. Must now begin the offensive against charcoal. It's 
gonna be a very, very loss intensive fight though, that's for sure. Cause Charcoal still has a lot of troops and they could do a lot of damage to us. Yup. Wait, why did Blue s Charcoal send me a thumbs up? Good game. Are they gonna wipe me out? Is Charcoal gonna wipe me out? Ooh. So it begins. Yo, I do like Charcoal's position though. Man. Yep, try to take continents that aren't next to the computer, that's for sure. And and if you can't keep it, let it go. Dang, dude. Charcoal has four cards at the moment. That is really bad for us. Yup. This is gonna be one of those games where the computer gets really, really big. Yep. Charcoal was just sitting and waiting for their moment to attack. It's a pretty good move, honestly. I would destroy my 13, but I don't know. We'll see. Alrighty, boys. Obviously, we have to get rid of this continent of theirs. Dude, I'm kind of scared because they have five cards at the moment, you know? Yeah, I would be scared, man. I would be. Yep, I just have to- I'm, I just have to let Blue do a lot of damage. Yeah, I might have lost this one. I don't know, dude. Charcoal's- Car bonus is gonna be massive. It is, it is. I know I cashed in those three infantry earlier, and now we need an infantry bad. This is really bad for us, man. Oh, he was only a four! Oh, that's good. Hmm. Those were heavy losses right there, man. Like, there's barely any of us left on the board. Just a bunch of ones and threes. Yeah, I know, we're getting gassed out bad. You know? Hmm. How are we gonna win this one? Very, very carefully. Please, please, bro. Did we get an infantry, bro? Because I need an infantry bad. Ooh. Cashing in those infantry earlier might have cost me the game, man. That's, like, that's the truth of the matter. Yep. Getting away, getting as far away from blue as possible is going to be the way to win this game. And whoever can cash in the car bonus first, ooh. That's going to be a game ender right there. Like, like, no doubt about it, man. Because Blue's armies are big and they're coming, right? They're coming for sure. This is bad for us, man. Ooh. 
really bad for us. This might look crazy, what I'm about to do, but I think it might make sense. We'll see. Unless blue absolutely destroys those troops, then it was not worth it. Hmm. Oh, snap! Are those troops gone? Alright. Alright, blue, relax. Dang, dude. Look at the computer's number of troops. Alright. Is Charcoal gonna cash in their troops? If they do, we might be screwed. Really? Dude, Charcoal's coming for me, man. Holy smokes. Dang, dude. Charcoal's trying to make a defense against my army, but... That ain't happening, bruv. But at this point, it's just about surviving, man. It really is. Beautiful. We got rid of their continent bonus and their massive army, but they now have five cards! We're done for, man. Yeah. I might have doomed us, like, bad. Ooh, relax, Blue. Alright, Blue's going towards charcoal really bad. Yeah, there's, uh, I mean, the computer isn't that great, so there might be coming back from this, but I don't know. Ooh, another big bonus. Oh, shoot. Uh-oh. We, we can't get rid of their continent. Dude, we just lost, man. <sighs> we just lost, and we just lost bad. Man, that's- that's game. That sucks, man, but that's game right there. Unless... Unless Blue can get rid of Charcoal's continent, that's game. But the computer really isn't that aggressive. see. Uh, if I was charcoal, I would destroy me as soon as possible, but we'll see what happens. Hmm. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Do we have good cards? No, we don't.
All right. I'm putting my faith in the computer. If the computer's 35, can attack charcoal's 20? You know? Beautiful. Not so beautiful. Do it. Attack if you're 59 to their 20. Come on, dude. <gasps> oh, yes! Yes, dude! We're back. Haha. -ha. My gamble paid off, man. Oh, don't. Oh. Oh. Well, both horse, both charcoal and I, man, we're beat down bad. Honestly, I still like charcoal's position over mine, but still, man, I have no movement, and it won't be long until the computer destroys my troops, like one thousand percent. Honestly, I don't know, like. Those, they're only going to keep putting more troops there, and I'm only going to get three troops per turn, so... Yep. Honestly, though, Charcoal is also trapped in. But they're going to survive being trapped in longer than I am. That's for sure. I mean, like... Oh, man, this is terrible. It really is. I'm gone, dude. That's game. Dang, this stinks, man. <gasps> Ooh. Man, that stinks. Can Charcoal come back from this? Um... They don't have any routes to attack through, though. There's, like, there's a weakness in the seven right there of Charcoals, but... In the purple continent, but that'd be the closest thing to possibly a weakness. I guess that 15 right there is a kind of weakness. I mean, they just gotta try and break through, basically anywhere, and try to get behind Blue's lines. Ooh. It looks like they're just trying to move their troops as far away as possible, but... Mm, that won't work. You have to... They had to have tried to have broken through. Obviously, with a numerical advantage like this, it looks pretty impossible, though. But, you never know sometimes. Yep. Well, we knocked out Porcelain and Red, but we just didn't have quite what it took to finish off Charcoal. Yeah, our battle with Porcelain took too long. That's probably a part of it, too. Yep, that's game, though, for Charcoal. I mean, they could try to break through somewhere, but... Like that 18, you know. But... Yeah. Oh well.
Novice, Intermediate, Beginner, Master. Alright, alright. Turn off the music. Check our stats. Alright, we went down. Okay, alright. Well, yeah. Well, that's been another uh, game of risk, Global Domination, you know? Um, mm, yeah. Well, we'll see if we do better on the next playthrough, because that map is still really good. Anyways, I've been Moonblast, and I'll see you guys in the next game of Risk Global Domination.